Hello Super Zeus, so today we're going to learn how to transpose chords in Finale. So you have this chord progression all set up, you come over here, highlight everything, right click, hit transpose, and go oh no, down a major second, hit OK, and nothing happens. That's because this normal transpose tool in the right click is for transposing notes, not chords. So instead we have to do something slightly different, we have to come up here to Utilities, we have to change chords, and here you can find a whole bunch of tools that you can change chords with, but we want this one here called Transpose. Same dialog box as before. In fact, it'll even save whatever you just did. Hit OK, hit OK, and there we go. We have transposed the chords. It's nice and simple. Now there is one more thing I just want to talk about with transposing chords, and that's when the chords will automatically be transposed for you without even thinking about it. So let's just go over here, uh, and we can do this with pretty much any percussion save because percussion staves are by default set in the key of C. So we're going to come over here, um, let's find, let's find drum set, okay? Because so often, you'll have a drum set part, and we're going to change the key of this piece. So let's change the key to, I don't know, E major, okay? What do you notice? The chords in this instrument have changed, but not in the drum set part. And that's because non-pitch percussion staffs are always going to display as if they're in C. Even if you, like, go up here to toggle, display at concert pitch, right? It's still going back and forth. It doesn't do anything. Or even if we come over here to score manager and try to change the transposition on the G, E flat like that. The chords are always going to come up as if they're in C. And so how do we fix it? Well, we fix it the exact same way we just did. Highlight the part, come up here, here to utilities, change chords, hit transpose. And instead of down a major second, we actually want up a major third. That's just because that's the distance between the B7 and the B flat 7. Up a major third, hit OK, hit OK, and there. Now we have transposed the chords in the correct key. That's it for today. That's a quick video on how to transpose chords in Finale. If you want to know how to transpose other things like percussion instruments, I have a link to a video in the description below. If you found this video helpful, make sure to hit the like button. That way I know you want more content just like this. And each week I post new videos on how to use Finale to its fullest, so if you don't want to miss out on any of those, make sure to hit the subscribe button, that way you get notified as soon as any video comes out.